Good morning and welcome to our worship here at Burns Mosa for Sunday, February the 19th. Uh, you might be able to hear it in my voice, uh, but after three years, I finally uh, succumbed to COVID-19. Um, I came down with it yesterday, or last week rather, on Sunday afternoon and uh, tested positive on Monday morning. And uh, so it's been a, uh, a long week and I'm slowly recovering from it. A reminder that you can still donate online or on the PWSND, at the PWSND website or through your weekly offering here at Burns Mosa as we try and help all of those affected by the terrible earthquake in Syria and Turkey. Uh, if you are going to donate through this congregation to help, just make sure that you clearly mark your envelope or your check, uh, Syria, Turkey earthquake. There is a musical event coming up on Friday, March the 3rd at 7 p.m. at Knox St. Thomas. It's called Three of a Kind, Oldies Rock and Fun, uh, and it features three singers who are regular performers at the Victoria Playhouse in Petrolia. You can get advanced tickets by calling Knox St. Thomas or from Carl or Heather or Mary Ann McVicker. Also an invitation and reminder that our next Burns Family Fellowship is uh, on February the 25th at 6 p.m. We are starting the evening off with a potluck dinner and then followed by some uh, games, from a games night. And so please bring your favorite food and your favorite game and we will have a good time together. The World Day of Prayer is holding its first in-person event since 2019. It will be held at Glencoe Presbyterian Church at 10 a.m. on Friday, March the 3rd. And next Sunday, February the 26th, we will be holding a short congregational meeting immediately after worship, uh, where we will discuss and vote on legally transferring the cemetery lands across the road uh, to a soon to be incorporated nonprofit, which will be based on our current cemetery board. Uh, please plan to attend that congregational meeting. Finally, I want to remind everyone that we will be celebrating communion here in the sanctuary and online on Sunday, March the 5th. Each week for the next couple of months, I, we will continue to highlight the different ways our Presbyterian sharing budget is spent. And so I invite you to watch this short video. 